Um, thanks very much for uh, tuning in to uh, Bloom Tube and today the tutorial is going to be on a fairy wand. Here we go. Oh, there we go. I think we can just see it all there. I give her a little twirl round. Oh, hang on. There we go. And I'm just trying to think how many it's. Um, it's five balloons. Five balloons. Four 160s and a six inch quick link. All right. So hopefully that's where it is. Now, what you have to do, you um, you inflate your quick link to um, with your pump um, two strokes of the pump. All right. And then you must tie, or you haven't got to, I say you must, you don't have to at all. It's just the way that I like to do it. I tie a knot in the top bit of the quick ring, because then that will grip onto the, um, for the hair, it helps to hold it all on and in place, all right? So um, I've told you that, but I've got to do the, uh, the arms first. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I've got a bit ahead of myself there, did not I? Right, so you need two 160s. Right, if I knew what I was doing, all right? Uh, and the 160s leave three fingers uninflated. All right, you're going to need a one finger bubble and a two finger fold twist. All right, so just a, quite a small two finger fold twist. Push the bubble through the fold twist, it won't come undone. Uh, do the same on the other one. It's like stereo, isn't it? Stereo. <laughs> so a two finger fold twist again. Uh, push that through. Now I have a, uh, I squeeze the air along and I have a six finger bubble for the arms. So six finger bubble and then a uh, one and a half finger bubble and you pinch twist that. Now you go back to the first one, squeeze the air along, six finger bubble for the arms. And then this one, uh, you're gonna go around the pinch twist, all right? And then you're gonna have a little uh, spacer bubble and another pinch twist. So it's another one and a half finger bubble and a pinch twist. Then in the first one, which is on the first pinch twist here, you've got to make your spacer bubble to go to there. There we go, like that. So you should have your arms there, pinch twist, two one finger bubbles there, another pinch twist. And now we're gonna make the, uh, the wing. So squeeze the air. Uh, along a little bit and um, on this side as well now the wings um, on the one I showed you they were five hands I was thinking of going to do them a bit bigger and do them six so one two three four five six uh, you know, we might get to five it might make it a bit short one two three four five yeah we're gonna go we're gonna keep with five all right so that's five there that goes around the pinch twist and we come back on the other one, five again. One, two, three, four, five. It goes down the pinch twist. So these are gonna be the wings. Now, you wanna come back to this first pinch twist. So we're just gonna push the air along that balloon so it's just um, an uninflated section. All right, so just push that along. And we're going around the uh, first pinch twist. Do the same on the other one. Let's have a look. So these are going to be the wings. You need your oops, a pinch twist on only have at the top. They'll sit in the centre. And um, the arms around a little bit. Um, then we have a, as he's looking over to the double check, <laughs> about a six finger bubble here and you've got a twist in it. Uh, same on the other side, that six finger bubble. So that'll end up for your, uh, for your wings. Now, one of these generally is going to be a little bit longer than the other, so you have to make them so that they are about the same. So just stretch one to make sure they're the, roughly about the same size, and you're going to pack these. Now, when you do this, um, some people just do one around. You must go like this, across, back. Try and do it as many times as you can. And go, keep going, keep going. And then once you get right to the end, little bubble, and put one of the bubbles through, because that will lock it in place. So, there we go, and that's the end that. So this is your, do um, a little bit more of a shock twist there. So that's, uh, 
press this section. I'm not going to show you this one. As you can see, they look a little bit similar. Right. Now then, we're going to do the hair. So you need, um, I'm doing it in yellow. Gold might look quite nice. So you're going to need um, two um, pinch twists. Um, oh, sorry. You need two, um, two finger pinch twists. Maybe two. Forget the pinch twists. You need two two finger bubbles. That's what you need. The knot goes around the second one. You know, put that through. Then you make one pinch twist. All right, one finger bubble, one pinch twist. All right. And then the balloon goes around these two pinch twists. All right, there you go. That's what you do. And that's going to be like her. Uh, Alright, okay. that's gonna sit like that. You then need a four-finger bubble, and now you need two two-finger pinch twists. I knew they were there somewhere, I just thought we were quite sure where it was. There you go. So twist these two together and then the 160 goes over the top like so. The quick link is gonna go around here. So where I said tie that in a knot. Now, so that that's got something to grip on, you see. Right. Now, on the quick link, I've done a soft knot here, and I'm going to pull that knot forward a little bit, and get a small bubble, like he says, there we go. A maximum of a two finger, because this is going to be her neck, all right? And then you do this into a, um, a pinch twist. So I've got that nice and tight. Just give you a little bit of a neck there. So this comes down, right? and generally it's about a seven finger bubble. Look at that, it's about seven fingers on it. And then you need a uh, one finger bubble, pinch twist that. Now we need a spacer bubble. So um, about one and a half finger bubble there, and that's going to go around the pinch twist. All right. Wrap that a couple of times around, and back for your spacer bubble again. About the same size, go around the pinch twist, and then you come back up to the top of the hair. There and that ends up to there. Alright, and we'll show you on this one. Alright, so um, we've done these two here, and we're going to do the middle one now, and that's going to be just fractions smaller, so those first two curve around, you see. So they were seven, so I would do a six. Uh, oh, not let the air out there, it's a little bit on the... Yeah, there you go. Uh, and about a six finger bubble there. Tie that up. And then that goes into the uh, pinch twist there. And then like that. So that's going to be the back section of the hair. Now we've got to have um, another um, yellow 160, again three fingers uninflated, and you need a little small one and a half finger bubble, and that's going to go around the pinch twist, and the reason for that is that that is going to tie onto the back of the wings, so that uh, the head is supported at the neck and um, the back of the hair, so it holds it all in place a lot. Nicer. Uh, you're going to do a seven finger bubble, so you squeeze the air along. So, seven finger bubbles about there. Then you want uh, two small bubbles, uh, about uh, one and a half, two finger. These are going to be pinch twist. So, um, put this to there, twist these over. The 160 goes over the top. And you want another pinch twist a little bit bigger. So, just about a, a three finger bubble. So, the three finger bubble there. That goes into these two pinch twists. There. And then we need a small one finger bubble, and that is going to go into the two pinch twists here. So that goes around there. And this is going to be the front section of a hair. We need another spacer bubble, which is another one finger bubble, around those three pinch twists. A seven finger bubble goes down the other side of a hair. We're hopefully getting it all in the uh, Position that goes into the pinch twist at the back, like so. And just adjust the 
Ừ, 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 There is space here and here, so we go up and put a six finger bubble in there and a six finger bubble down the other side, and that's a uh, yeah, I'll just uh, put that through, measure a, a six finger bubble. It goes into the three pinch twists at the top there. And then come down the other side. And, uh, another six finger bubble. And I forgot to tell you, I wasn't going to do the artwork wrong. Because <laughs> uh, my artwork is not fantastic. So, uh, right, so once you've got that into there, there are, uh, get rid of this, this is excess now. Cutters, scissors, don't use your teeth because that's terrible. And uh, what we'll do, you know, here we go. I do have the scissors handy sometimes. So this is her. Now the um, the pinch twist on the blush goes round in between the uh, two arms there, around that pinch twist. So we put that on there, put that around, go forward, be quite aggressive with each one. <laughs> well, fingers crossed with each one. And, uh, So you've got your, your, your pinch twist of the 160 there, pinch twist of the flush there to give us all the neck. And then this bubble here, the, uh, the one which was from the, uh, the second part of her hair, that's going to go into the pinch twist on, her, uh, on the wings. All right, that just gives her a, a little bit more support. Otherwise, you might get a bit of a wonky pinch, see. And then just got to adjust the um, shock twist the arms a little bit, just give me a little shock twist to give her. There she is. And um, there's your fairy angel wand. Alright, and uh, let me just come. Here we go. Here's the one I made earlier. So hopefully they do look a little bit similar. Right, and uh, let me just come forward so you can see if you want to have a look at what I've done on the artwork. There you go. Alright. Right. Thanks very much for watching. Very much appreciated. Put that one down there. And if you could hit the subscribe button, that would be uh, excellent. It's always nice to get a few more uh, people subscribing and um, looking at uh, Balloon Tube. And uh, we might see you again sometime. So it's uh, bye from me, and it's bye from the angel. And uh, we'll see you another time on Balloon Tube. Bye.